Uh, no need for recon, Mr. C. Yeah, I hear some banging noise. Yeah, yeah, one of the shutters came loose, and, uh, you know, I tied it down, but with the wind kicking up. Can you get somebody to stop it? Yeah, yeah, right away. It's really, the noise, it's really annoying. Got it, boss. Station of your rather disturbing death wish. Don't do that. You're not going anywhere. Your son, he's here. So what do you think? You're going to go waltzing down the stairs? He might see you. Which means that, for the time being, you are more or less my captive. Uh -huh. I think we might as well enjoy it. Okay. Okay. This is really... It's wonderful. I'm very titillating. <laughs> yeah. And in a danger. And this sudden passion for me, but it doesn't all ring true. You're after something. Why don't you just tell me what it is? Stop. You, Stop it. You're really not going to let me seduce well, you. Well, call me crazy, but, you know, the urge kind of is gone after I, two guys are standing outside my door, both of which are known for carrying weapons, and the other one is insanely irrational husband. Listen, you're Sonny's brother. He pretty much hates you, but you're still bound. Yeah, that's not a lot of comfort, Claudia. Okay, look, since we know that sex by distraction is off the table, why don't you just tell me why you're trying to manipulate Why do you have to insult me? Why you gotta stall, Claudia? Come on. I, I want to know the truth. About what? Well, my father's agenda. I know he has one. I just haven't figured it out I yet. I told you, I don't know. Don't you know what? Don't, don't insult my intelligence. My father brought Sonny into this organization for a specific purpose. You know what it is. Now, considering I'm stuck in the middle between my crazy, psychotic, dangerous father and my potentially psychotic husband... The least you can do is tell me exactly what kind of mess I've got myself into okay. here. First thing you need to know is... Anthony's not paralyzed. Get the hell no, Anthony, out! Anthony walks just fine. He also shoots his rifle. Which he did. On Sonny's wedding day. I knew the night that Kate got shot that Karpov didn't do it. Obviously, you did too. How'd you find out? Well, I walked in on Anthony. Found him standing there dismantling his rifle. And what, he admitted it to you? That speaks of some kind of trust or... Mm. I don't know about that. Look, obviously, Anthony was trying to blame Kate shooting on the Russians. He knew that Sonny was going to spin out of control. He also knew that Sonny was going to probably be obsessed with going after Karpov. Which is exactly what happened. Yeah, but Sonny didn't have the resources to go after the Russians, and he knew that he would go to Jason for help. Who would turn him down, and then he would come right to us. No. Your father offered his car organization to Sonny under the condition that he would marry you. That way he had Sonny deeper in a hole. I mean, Anthony wants to keep his friends close and his enemies closer. He also wanted to make sure that he had his eyes and ears in this house. Hey, I'm not... Nobody ever said that I had to spy on Sonny. Hey, you, you don't have to. You're already here. Look at you. Your father's been pulling your strings since the day you were born. He knows that you're loyal to the family. He also knows that you're going to give him any information that he asks you know for. what my father does? He underestimates me. And so do you. I cannot believe that you've known this the whole time and you didn't tell me. Well, what do you say? Come on, it's easy, Claudia. I didn't know I could trust you. And frankly, I'm still not sure. You got... You gotta understand something. I am. I'm risking my life by telling you this. I know how my father deals with betrayal. And I know what you're risking. On the other hand, you're already in it this far. You might as well finish. Right? All right, Sonny's in Scots with his car organization. Your father's. I'm going to try to escalate the tension with Jason, knowing that Sonny's going to eventually have to make a move. 
Jason being forever loyal won't strike back. Sonny will kill Jason. My father will kill Sonny and crown himself the king of the world. Yeah, so far a few road bumps and father's plan is working okay and you're okay with you're okay with this I'm the messenger no rick in order for this plan to work out your brother has to die you're okay with that Yeah, I was, um, checking my email and returning it and stuff. In your room? No, I was up in the, the upstairs den. You didn't hear the banging? Banging? Yeah. Somebody's banging in this house. It must be Max or Milo, because it damn sure ain't me. No, not that kind of banging. Just, like, noises. No, I had my earbuds in. You know how I like to listen to my music really loud? Probably regret it one day when I can't hear anything, but... I like to block out the world with it, you know? You all right? Something bothering you? No. You mean, other than the fact that Jason blew up as a car shipment and you're refusing to retaliate and my father's fury is now? Well, that you knew where things stood all. as soon as the shipment was blowing up, so... Why, why, why are you so nervous? Why are you suddenly acting like you care? Because you're jumping out of your skin! Which tells me you're lying. Just want to know why. What's going on with you lately? Snooping around my house? Scared? It's not like you. You don't know what I'm like. Oh, well, hey, you're tough. You're loyal, you're, you know, you married me for the good of your family. Some people will do anything for power. Oh, so what you're saying is you expected more power when you married me? Well, I don't know what I expected. I mean, honestly, you didn't know what to expect either, but I liked having power in my family. I liked that my father looked at me for once like I was good for something. But that's changing. Johnny might actually be out of the business for good. My father's furious. He's trying to undercut you, and I'm not exactly sure where that leaves me, but I have no protection. Also, is that what you is that what your uh, is that what you want protection from your father? I don't know. What if it is? I mean, if if I was asking you for that, would you give it to me? Yeah. So I didn't think so. We did not agree to lay down our lives for each other, Claudia. Okay. Well, I don't know exactly what we agreed to in in this marriage, but you know, at first I thought for a little while that that we'd have a friendly cohabitation that. We'd hang out and cook together and drink good wine and, I don't know, we'd show each other some respect. I treat you with enormous respect. No, you do most of the time and I want to give it back to you. Yeah. I want... Why don't you tell me what you're trying to hide? I don't know where to begin. Well, is this about Anthony? It's about a lot of things, but you mm -hmm. should know that my father is yeah. really not happy with you and there's always another level to his plans all i can do with you father. a lot of people have thought that mm -hmm. it's part of it's part of the way he works he 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 wants his enemies to think that he could be had because mm -hmm. he says it gives him an edge mm -hmm. i have no illusions about your father he's not exactly everything that he appears oh so he's not really nuts oh no he's definitely nuts but not in the way that you think can we stop talking in riddles? Because this is about as scared as I've ever seen you. You gotta tell me why.